Hey, Pastor Ron here. This week we continued our series called My Enemy. And, you know, one of the things that our enemy does, Satan does, is, is he's our accuser. In fact, the Bible says that, that, you know, he is the accuser of the brothers and sisters, the accuser of the brethren, and, and he does this day and night. It's something that he is continually trying to get into our head and tell us that we're not good enough. Tell us because of, you know, our sin and our mistakes and, you know, all of this stuff that we don't deserve God's love. We don't deserve his forgiveness. We're all this. We're all that. It's part of what he wants to do. And, and, and honestly and unfortunately, we allow it to happen. Man, isn't his voice loud in those circumstances and situations? I mean, at first he'll lie to us and say, oh, go ahead and do that, or go ahead and say that, or you, you deserve to be angry and lose your temper, and you, you should just do it. And then the moment that we mess up, man, then he's condemning us for it in, in our mind. And You know, there's no condemnation in Christ. The Bible says that. If we're feeling guilt and shame, which is exactly what our enemy wants us to feel, man, that's coming straight from him. See, God is about forgiveness and he's about grace and mercy. And that doesn't mean that, that, that we don't have to answer for our mistakes and our faults and we're not gonna go have to go through some things because of them. But if you're living in that guilt and shame, man, it's time to let that go. See, in Zechariah, he talked about, you know, Joshua standing before God and there was the accuser, Satan, kind of the prosecutor, if you will. And here comes Joshua and his robes all dirty and filthy. And that was a representation of sin and, him, he, he wasn't supposed to be that way, but here he was standing in front of God, a filthy man. But the angel of the Lord, some say Jesus, steps in and says, hey, I got that. Why don't you take that dirty robe off? Why don't you put on something clean? And let's get back to work. Serve me, love me, let's go. So today, if you're struggling with guilt and shame, if you're struggling with your past, if you're struggling with a sin or a mistake that you've made, would you just give it to God? Would you just simply ask for forgiveness? Would you accept that clean robe that he's got for you? And then get up and get after it. Listen, Jesus paid the price for it. We just as well accept it. We don't deserve it, but it's there. It's for us to live in. This has been a CPC Minute.